you, you talk about set pieces, and you know, after a game like Northampton, you, you, you know you weren't happy with that aspect. So that, is that what you then take to the training ground, or is it, or is it an accumulation of things over the last few weeks? And now you've got a chance to work on them all. Yeah, it's not just that. I'd be lying if we just. It's not just that because, just like I said, we were, we were acting them we were four, and they were just as big and just as strong and just as tall, and we were under absolute north threat. So you can't just sort of throw the baby out, look at back water just because of one result. Um, or one element of that result. We actually played really well at Northampton. Um, we have to do that work, of course. It's not just that work. There's, there's, other, there's plenty of other bits um, that we've got to improve on and keep improving on. Because, you know, such pieces are just one small element of it. It's, you know, and it was small. Uh, we, we talked about defending set pieces. We actually win a lot of set pieces, particularly corners. You had 11 at Northampton. It's difficult because you haven't, you haven't got a real six foot five giant to aim for. Yeah. I mean, are you looking at more invention from those things and thinking outside the box because you didn't have, you did score from one actually, but you, you, right have, you have, well, yeah, but you haven't had, you know, 11 corners is a lot, you think you perhaps could be a bit more dangerous from them. Um, maybe, maybe, uh, but again, it's, it's, I'd say that's an area to improve, but if you said every, I don't know how many corners we'd scored, at, you know, had before we scored, but if you said we were going to score off, one every eight corners, say something like that. Well, I'll take that. Um, you know, especially against a team like Northampton, who I think probably pride themselves on on, on set pieces. Um, so yeah, it's I, I saw that as a real positive, irrespective of the number of corners. Um, the fact that we scored one, that's hard to score. You don't score every week from corners or set pieces. So it's an area that we have to improve on. We have had lots of different scorers, you know. Um, you know Mickey Hunt scored from a free kick, and Eddie's got I think mean, three or four, mm-hmm. you know. So they're all they're all chipping in, um, and, and Jack, I'm talking saying about them players because generally they come from set pieces. So we've got to make sure that continues, and um, it's, an, it's it's still an area to improve. Um, you know, how far up the list of priorities is? Is open to question. And so it's uh, it's Morecambe. Last time they visited, there was a good result. You wouldn't expect anything like that this time around, I'm sure. But um, you know, a game that you'll be favourites to win, um, and you'll expect to win. I expect to win all games, um, but they'll, they'll be tough not to cry. I'm sure they will. Um, whether that's because of the previous result, whether that's because it was a new manager, the added impetus that he brings. Well, that's because they play a different way. Well, all, all them things are making it harder for us, and we've got to make sure that we have the answers. Is it an added difficulty for you to prepare when it's a new manager, and you haven't, you know, you haven't really had an opportunity to see what changes you might have? He's had a free week as well to work on things, hasn't he? Does that make it more tough? Yes and no. At the end of the day, we, we say it often, if we do what we are capable of, then we've got a chance in every game. Morecambe's no different. It's no different from Northampton. It'll be no different at Forest Green. We've got to make sure that we play to our levels, and if we do that, then we'll give anyone a game, irrespective of new manager, formation, personnel. And that's, that's the most important mindset to have.